The Wilmington Library has stood as a city landmark since the 1920s. Today, it is in great need of costly repairs and renovations. And in order to pay for it, library officials announced today they will auction off the famous works of N.C. Wyeth. Uh, the decision was reached after many years of uh, deliberation and considerations and exploration of our options. The auction will take place December 2nd in New York at Christie's. The Wilmington Library is selling 14 oil paintings from the Robinson Crusoe collection and an Edward Curtis collection of books. An art handling and shipping company from New York traveled to Wilmington to collect the works. What they're doing right now is they are removing them from the existing frames. They're uh, packaging them uh, very carefully to make sure they're not damaged in transit. The Wilmington Library has owned the Wyeth pieces for about 85 years. N.C. Wyeth sold them to the library uh, because he wanted them to be viewed. Wyeth's work often sells for hundreds of thousands of dollars and one sold for more than two million dollars. So selling the pieces will bring in much needed capital and money for a new roof as well as modernizing the building's heating and cooling systems which currently rely on the DuPont company across the street. Not particularly modern. <laughs> the city of Wilmington owns the building and the library operates rent free but is responsible for the building's upkeep. For decades, the paintings have graced the library's walls in the children's and main reading rooms. People have come to see them and they will continue to see them. The library will keep the tradition by hanging high quality prints of the Robinson Crusoe collection on the walls. You can read more about the auction and the history of the paintings in today's news journal. For Delaware Online, I'm Patty Petit.